Welcome back to another episode of Alphabet Duos. We are headed towards the end of the alphabet, and today we have letter W, and we're going to be hanging out with Wheezy Jacket, a long-standing community member of Super Animal Royale and content creator. Excited to hang out with them, get to ask them some of the interview questions. I know they're going to have a unique perspective on a lot of things, but before we get into that, I want to announce what Alphabet Duos 0.5 is going to look like. <clears throat> For Alphabet Duos 0.5, I am going to be running back the entire alphabet once again. And we are going to be once again trying to get moderators, content creators, super content creators, developers onto alphabet duos, except 0.5 is going to mean we are just going to have the interview questions and the kills and result of each game. So we can have a little bit of a shorter, more bite-sized episode and so that it won't take me as much time to edit each one of the episodes so that we can run through one more alphabet without burning out so if you have any creators that you think i missed the first time of any letter of the alphabet go ahead and toss them down below because i'm going to be looking to make a whole nother list of 0.5 creators that we can get to know through their interview questions and just to see the results of our games together now that we have that out of the way let's go ahead over and hang out with wheezy wheezy what's going on how you doing today uh Good, man. How are you doing? <laughs> I'm doing pretty well. Are you ready for some alphabet duos? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, I am absolutely ready. <laughs> okay, well, before we start, let me ask you this. How many wins do you think we are going to get out of five today? You know, honestly, like, I'm kind of aiming for at least two. Just two. Two? All right, two yeah. out of five, I'm sure we'll, hopefully we'll be able to do that. We'll, we'll see what happens. But before we get into the first game, let's ask this first interview question. How long have you been playing Super Animal Royale? So I've been playing Super Animal Royale since January 3rd of 2019. So a couple weeks after the uh, Steam release, So which Jeez. came out in 2018. So that is that well very, <laughs> very, very, that may be the oldest number that we've heard, maybe other than Funko Logan himself. That's crazy. All right, so a OG player. What was going on in the game? Was there even a season one yet, or was that pre-seasons and everything? Um, there was actually, like, no seasons. So, okay. like, everything else was, like, pre-seasoned, I would say. Wow. Like, I think when we got seasons, it was, like, around... 2020 i believe okay. so so definitely season. one of the most seasoned yeah players of all time that we've seen in alphabet duo so this is gonna be a little special episode right here i have not played for a little bit so this is gonna be interesting and we have to also oh, yes. okay uh what is this a yeah. 40 40 percent lobby no i'd say this is pretty populated for what's going yeah, on today it's, yeah it's not that bad all right well game number one i'm gonna let you choose where do you want to go alice <laughs> <laughs> Where? Pa Palace? Yeah. What? I don't know if I've ever seen someone come up here before. What the? It's literally the best drop in the game. You know. Really? That's that's your and opinion. I'm not saying this is because uh, I'm a penguin. Yeah, or just because there is. <laughs> just say there's some sort of penguin propaganda going on right now. Yep. Yeah. Look at these big guys right here. All right. Well, I don't get to play off here too often, so. It'll be you know, nice usually, to play a game up here. Yeah, usually not a lot of people drop here. Unless it's like in the beginning of the flight path, I would say. Yeah. Was I really... Oh my! You good? They're right here. Oh. Oh, okay. Pop Gamers pop down. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh, oh no. Okay. Okay. Super right laser. That's I do not like to see that though. Yes, I did. One pressure. Yeah, probably. The bot just killed them. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> they ran into oh, a bot cool. and it killed them. You can push. Nice. Good pressure. Okay. Uh, bind the rock. What is happening? What a weird game that's happening right now. Knock who's on They must have went back down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit him once, hit him once. Nice, good knock. 
Nice. Okay. All right. First game of Alphabet Duos with the Weezer. And we end up with a W. How many kills, Weezy? Two. Two? Oh, wow. I felt like you had a lot more than that. All right. Well, I had 12. So we get a double digit 14 kill win for game number one. You really were just the support, weren't you? You just were yeah, bow tracking like, people, and I was just chasing them down with a deagle like a psycho. Yeah, like, bow, having a bow play on your team provides so much intel. Yeah, that's like, awesome. You do, you do not understand how useful bow actually is. Let's head to question number two, though. How did you find out about Super Animal Royale? So I found out about Super Animal Royale through a good friend of mine who is a moderator named Mochime. Uh, shout out to her that uh, showed me the game. She's been playing for quite a while, and she's an amazing friend. I've known her before Super Animal Royale, actually, so I'm actually glad that she showed me this game. So <laughs> yeah, And I've been addicted to it since, so... <laughs> Shout out Mochi. So Mochi yep. showed you. Now, I always ask this question, but I actually already know the answer. Whenever it was via a friend invite, I always ask, have you outlived the friend or do they still play the game to this day? And I think um, I, I know that answer. Mochi is uh, definitely... Honestly, yeah. Mochi's, Mochi may still plays quite a bit, even, yep. even though uh, she's been playing the game for a while, so. All right, play on me, it is a bot. All right, bots are gone. All right, well, I didn't really talk about game number two starting because we were uh, talking about that, but we did land at the Beaver Construction. I mean, that part of Beaver Construction used to be like villas or something. Oh, that's quite a. Oh, uh, jeez, uh, I'm literally getting meleeed by them. Populated, you know. Uh, I honestly do not know what it would take for that to happen. Oh, oh, my shotgun shot didn't even go off. Careful, that's a real player. Yeah. Ah, this is gonna be on you. Play your life. If yeah. you need to just completely leave me. Okay, yeah, I'm getting finished. Play your life. Yeah, I, I really have to leave. Yeah, like, go for it. The bot distraction there was crazy. Bot shotguns off my armor and then a real team runs on us. All right, Weezy, so we're really gonna get to spectate the skills here. It's a second Memphapsis skin. One of the derpiest faces I've ever seen in a online video game skin. Yeah. Ooh, tier three out of the box. Nice. Okay, that's, that's, that's huge. Dude, this so is like, gonna have to be a crazy <laughs> game out of you, your loser. Hard to play when my hands are cold. Okay, those guys are together. They did pick up a gold silence pistol out of that crate. Yeah, there's like a Thomas in there, I'm pretty sure. Uh, looks like there are some bot squads still around as well. Alright, good. I'm yeah, we would want to have some nades here. Oh. Nice, you knocked that one. That other team was the team that killed me as well. Nice! Wow, what a shot there. Oh my goodness, alright. Wow, what a great pick up there as well. Alright, 1v1v1. One v one. One socked right now. You would hope that they would fight each other. Yep. Good track. One versus one. Hurt as well. Wow, what a great clutch. Nice. How many how many kills? Eleven. Eleven and dude, we just we completely just swapped characters here because I had three. So yeah. not, I think we had 14 again too, right? Because I had 12, you had two, and then I you have 11, I have three. Double 14 hey, kill games uh, back to back. I guess 14 is just my favorite number. Yeah, I know. <laughs> what is the chances of that? Well, great clutch up, and we already hit that two win mark. So what has been your favorite? Okay, let me, I don't know why I said it so slow. Let me try that again. <laughs> what has been your favorite addition to the game since you started playing? And you might have more time to talk about here on your hands than any other player we've ever interviewed oh, before. Oh, so man. just think about peak addition to the game all the way back since 2019. So like, honestly, my favorite um, update was when they released the Penguin Palace. Mm. In 2019, when they released Super Mario Tonight uh, Season 1, and this was, was this was episode seven, by the way. Hmm. 
they were they released penguins on that day and uh i've got so many uh pangs on that day like people mentioned me on twitter um they mentioned me in the sar discord they mentioned me in discord dms and they even mentioned me in the uh youtube live chat with the additions to penguin palace we also got an update to thomas's tundra where thomas's workshop is in place yeah. uh, we also got the thomas gun i believe and the thomas gun was really strong back then yeah it had 50 in the magazine instead of 35. Jeez. It was so, that powerful. So you just love everything that's been added up north, right? In the cold area. Yeah, yeah the pretty palace, much. Thomas's. Yeah. All right. Well, I would say that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> well, actually, let me ask you uh, this. What is your favorite gun skin in the game? Oh, that's... that's I know there's a lot tough. of skins in the game now. Oh, boy. Um, This is a tough one, but... I absolutely love the Cardinal Bow Skin. Cardinal Bow Skin? Yeah, because it gave you a Cardinal as a bird yeah. when you when you mark the enemy instead of just a normal uh, sparrow. Mm, got you. It was, it was very unique, and I absolutely loved it. Okay, game number three. I'll let this be up to you again. We can go back and forth. Go ahead, take us to another um, spot. That's Crocodile Club. Crocodile Club. Wow, you really do have the unique spots. I don't know the last time someone during Alphabet Duos has said, let's go to the Penguin Palace and let's go Crocodile Club. Yeah, people really underappreciate these spots. So. Yeah. I feel bad. That's definitely a new yeah. player. Drinking. I nice. got them to one. Oh, got got it. one. Oh, Oh, he still yeah. killed me! He was coming to the end of his clip, so I kind of started peeking, but somehow he was still holding right trigger. <laughs> you just tunnel vision so hard. Exactly. You forget how much ammo you have. Exactly. Yeah. It'll be, it'll be like that, I need to lock in. I need to start focusing completely on Sar, because what am I doing? Ooh. Ooh another oh, bow player, be careful. Hey, it sounds like you know him. Crawling to the bottom. Yeah, I don't think I can win that fight, so... Who was this player? It's Gren! That was Gren! Oh, dude, I have to be paying attention. What is happening? Yeah, they said your name. <laughs> Wait, they did? Oh my uh, gosh, I didn't even see it in chat. Dude, what the oh, heck? They, oh, they just got... Oh, they, they just, just died. Died. Even though I have a feeling you being an old head in the Star community, you wouldn't even know half of them. Oh, nice. What a bow yeah, shot like, there. I'm a little bit out of touch with the community. Yeah. Like, it's probably because of life in general, so. Yeah. So I've just been, I've just been busy, so. <coughs> the, the community hasn't really been the same since when I played. Like, everyone was so, like, uh, forthcoming, I would say. Like, we would all just hang out, but then people parted ways, probably because of life and whatnot, which, that is completely okay. That's weird that you say that. Oh, yeah, let's do this. Yeah. Ooh. Uh-oh, two automatic weapons being held. Always scary. I think they did find another team. Yep, they just took out a solo. Uh-oh, up there's an M16 as well. Yeah, this is kind of a bad spot. Oh, yep. wow. And every nice. M16 bullet landing. Before I forget, question number four. What is one thing you would like to see added into the game? Um, Anything. Let your imagination go ooh, wild. That's, yeah, that's that's really that's, I know. that's really tough. Yeah. Um, honestly, I just want to see like a new map, I would say. And I know it's been overly requested, but a new map would actually just um, provide so much diversity. Mm. With, with the game, I would say. Now, are you because, talking like, all new elements? Like, you want a completely fresh, no, none of the same locations? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, just a fresh new map. Yeah, a fresh new map, because, like, it would add so much diversity to the game. Now, would because, you like you to know, see a rotation? Yeah, like a, a map rotation. Okay, like would Apex. Be really great. Yeah. Okay. I was wondering, because some people are like... Apex is very diverse. Yeah, I was like, some people are just like, just retire this map completely and give us a fresh new map. But yeah, I, I would see some benefit in keeping both, you know? And yeah, kind of for sure. In between the two. All right, I like that answer though. A map, I don't think, feel like we've uh, heard that many people say them. I have heard a lot of ranked from a lot of the people. You know, some people want in-game friends lists where they can go cross-platform. 
Um, yeah. Usually it's things like that or a certain cosmetic or a certain weapon. But yeah, a whole map, that would be awesome. So. How surprised would you be on a scale for one to 10 if whatever this big update coming is, is a new map? What do you think the chances are? How surprised would you be? I would be very surprised, but the chances of it would be pretty slim, I would say. Because, like, they've, the devs have mentioned, even on stream, like, they've mentioned, like, they're still adding new uh, additions to the current map, even though it's been over five years, mm -hmm. so... Yeah, it would take them quite a while. Like, they're a small company. I think only, like, three people work on it, so... Honestly, what what area do you think is, like, the worst final circle? Which locate? Like, what area? Yeah, just of this map. Um, I hate when circles end here. I feel like it is the most boring and like when you get stuck okay. across the big body of water and it's just whoever has the hold down mouse yeah. one gun or the off screen I'm going to shoot you gun, you know what I'm talking about? Like, yeah, we'll that can be really like uninteractive when it finishes over there. Yeah, say. for sure. Yeah, because you, you know that feeling. You're over there and you have your... SMG and shotgun and the team above you is holding a BCG or a minigun and they're just holding down mass one across that river and there's no way you can push because you're extremely slow you can't go around because it's deep water so I really don't like when circles finish over there yeah back one I, I do agree it, it is a little rough down there also there's a there's a team door right got another player down nice. yep another one another player bottom left now bottom left I Out just took armor. armor. Yeah. Like, I'm not those types of people that like report people for camping or tunneling because the devs have literally repeat, repeatedly said. Okay, surely I'll end a bullet. There we go. There we go. Oh, dang. I know. Nice. I'm gonna back up for one second. Nice. Oh! It's off screen. I might honestly try to crawl back through here. Ooh. Seven seconds. Yeah, this is a rough situation. I'll take the bullet for you. Wait, what? Oh my gosh. Surely I don't live, right? I'm going to kind of crawl to the bottom. Maybe. Oh my, ah! oh my gosh. Oh, so I close. did grab the tier three. Yeah, I'm so glad you got, you got that. It's like, Holy oh moly. It's wow. What it's a recovery. Oh, it is. 2v1. Wow, nice, what nice. a recovery. What a way to win right there. Beautiful. That was Holy. awesome. All right, how many kills did you have? I had nine. And I had 10 for a total of 19 that game. Yeah. All right, and that is three out of four wins. Will we join the small percentage of creators who have hit that four out of five wins during our alphabet? I will. We will find out in just one second, but let's do this last question. What advice do you have to anyone else trying to become a content creator like yourself? So my advice to that is just 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 be yourself, honestly. Just have fun with what you're doing. Don't care about numbers. Um, always reach out to people, I would say, so you can network yourself and just just put yourself out there, honestly, yeah. as a whole. Don't try to follow um, uh, anyone's footsteps, I would say. Just make your own path with content creating. Yeah. We've kind of heard different parts of that from a bunch of other creators. Yeah, just uh, don't try to like perfectly emulate someone else, but like find your own path, you know, find your own little niche, you know, find uh, yeah. what you're interested in, make it something entertaining. So, yep. Solid answer. Whether, whether it's making a short or just making a uh, tech talk video, you know, you create your, your channel. Yeah. So, on how you want it. Exactly. Don't let anyone else create for you. Yeah. All right, yep, pretty good size. Last game, let's see what happens. All right, where do, your pick, you finish this off here. Where do you wanna go? Uh, let's just go Palace <laughs> on the last All one. right, we started there, let's finish there as well. Oh wait, this is an interesting question that I've been asking some content creators. And I actually saw you discuss this a little bit on Twitter. And so I kind of wanted to hear you out here. If yep. you were elected to be a super content creator, what would you want your item to be? So, like, 
I know I put this as a good show, but probably just a bald spot at that. Like, I, I saw like you a, say that. Now, why is that? Why is the bald spot half the item for you? There's, there's like a little inside joke with some of the SAR members that uh, people think I am quote unquote bald because I'm wearing a top hat. So. Ah, oh, so you're wanna, covering your wanna, bald spot. They want to know what's under the, the hat, all right. So you would have but, a wheezy bald spot? Yeah, just trademark it. That's you crazy. Have it now. That would it's be my, that would be the first time that we've honestly seen like a legacy meme added as a super content creator item. That would be funny. I mean, there's quite a lot of inside jokes within the community, so. Yeah, I like that. Oh. Oh. Yeah, it, it has. I shot him once. Wow, nice. my Thomas gun was absolutely shredded there. Oh, I did damage with that nade. Good. Oh Teammates above! Nice! Uh, but we're about to run this one back. Hopefully we get the same result as the last time. Yep. Uh, both of us alive, I'd say. Yo, oh, relax, Dookie. More. I don't want to lose my bow there. I'm just kind of using it just for style points at this point. Oh! I just got <laughs> nice. a nice grenade down there. Grenade. Oh boy, the That's silly weapon. I traded, thank goodness. Alright, let me go ahead and hit a little heal up then. And um, Oh I Oh no! Okay, hold on. We're gonna be split up for a second. Because I, I just ran into two different teams of two. I got one. There, I got back. This one's hit for 60 flesh, just finishing. One shot, nice. Yeah, one more. Alright, alright. <laughs> one versus one. I think I saw him top left. Top left, there was a 2v1. I could be capping, though. Oh, he went on the zip. He went on the zip. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. nice. Is it Juicer? Juicer? I saw Oh. Nice with the track. Sparrow launcher versus bow. A tail as old as time. Oh, he's about that to reload. Nice! And finishing it with the bow as well. <laughs> And we get the four out of five wins. Awesome. Dude, nice. four out of five, man. The tail end of Half Alphabet Duos has been so crazy. We've been having so many high kill and high amount of win, win uh, yeah. rounds. It's been crazy. All right. Well, um, here's how we usually end things off. First, I want uh, to ask you to shout out all of the different places that people can find you. And I'm going to make sure those links are in the top of the description for you. So you can follow me on Twitter at Wheezy underscore Jacket. I tend to post uh, announcements whether it comes to streaming or just IRL stuff or post a little uh, clip of my gameplay. Uh, I also try to post shorts on YouTube, Wheezy underscore Jacket. I also stream over on Twitch at Wheezy underscore Jacket mm. as well. So uh, if you like what you see, uh, feel free to follow me. Yeah, go check out Wheezy. Definitely an OG of the Star community, but they're, one of my favorite parts about Wheezy is that they're also good at a lot of other games as well. And so if you're not chronically Star brained like me, you can also go in and watch a variety of other games, which is fun. Um, one last yep. thing, go ahead and just use this last few seconds of the video to just say whatever you want. If it wants to be a shout out to another person or whatever words you have, go ahead. Yeah, so shout out to Mochi Mei for getting me into this game. Uh, I would if I if I didn't get in this game, uh, I probably wouldn't have been playing because of her. So shout out to her. Um, and I'm honestly hoping that this quarter two update for Super Morale will actually be a big comeback for the game because mm -hmm. the game has been pretty dry lately with in terms of content because we've just been getting like seasonal event updates and that's it it's just cosmetic purely so i'm really hoping um pixel's project pays off and that the community is satisfied with uh whatever update that they bring yeah and honestly like i really can't wait for that to happen so it can happen anytime in quarter two so and that's April, that's June. now yeah that's that is now so a lot of things to be excited for shout out mochi and uh, Wheezy, thank you for being a part of Alphabet Duos. Um, and I will talk to you very soon. Uh, no problem. Thank you for inviting me. You're welcome. Bye-bye.
Have, have a good day. You do. <laughs> All right, gamers. I appreciate you guys for being here, being a part of another Alphabet Duos. Shout out to Wheezy for being a part of the video. Wheezy is such a down to earth chill guy. Go follow the Weezer, please. And do not forget about Alphabet Duos 0.5 episodes starting right after letter Z is done recording. Toss those people into the comment section of who you would want to see if I reran the alphabet one more time. And like always, I will see you very, very soon for letter X of Alphabet Duos. Peace out. <laughs>